Hi, I'm Helen. I'm a first year student studying osteopathy at the British College of Osteopathic Medicine. At BCom, I have a combination of lectures and practical classes. Some modules are taught online, some face-to-face, -face, and some are a mix of both. On average, in the first term, my contact hours totaled around 20 hours per week. I found that most afternoons, I had the time to practice new techniques that we had learnt in our practical classes, or review material from lectures earlier in the week. My favourite module this term has been anatomy. It's been fascinating to learn how the body works while looking at the structure and function of particular body parts and muscles in so much detail. Our learning focused on the spine, the bones of the body and their landmarks, as well as their related muscles and ligaments. One of the best things is the satisfaction of being able to build upon my anatomical and physiological understanding of the body and then apply this knowledge in my practical classes. It's incredibly rewarding. I'm currently studying a module called Professional and Clinical Integration. In this module, we look at how we can be better practitioners by understanding the work of the General Osteopathic Council. By law, osteopaths must be registered with the council to practice in the UK. I've not found this module as engaging or as exciting as my other modules, but I know that it's really important to understand the work of the regulator. One thing I wish I'd known is how important it is to practice your practical skills outside of lessons. You can't just attend the class and expect to be able to learn the techniques straight away. You need to keep practicing and applying them. I applied to BCom with three A-levels in psychology, biology and chemistry. The entry requirements at BCom are 112 UCAS points, which normally includes a science subject like biology, but physical education, sports science and math are also considered. At university, you are in total control of your studies. You're responsible for making sure that you attend all your classes and highlight any worries with the appropriate university team as soon as possible. Because my classes only have around 25 students in them, you get so much more support from your lecturers than I had expected. Coursework varies depending on which module it's for. For example, in physiology, we produce a piece of academic writing. Exams can be written or in viva form, which is a speaking exam. Thank you.